New tonight, a story you will only see here about a close call on the railroad tracks in Morgan County where two teens, Bob, barely escaped a tragedy. It is quite a story. Fox 13's John Franke is in Mountain Green tonight to explain how, how this happened and why first responders believe it should never happen again. The signs couldn't be clearer. We have had so many incidents here of people trespassing in crazy ways. All too often, the warnings are ignored. It's stunning to me that people would really kind of check their brain at the door and say, I need a picture so bad, they have to go up on the transcontinental railroad tracks. Tuesday night, two teens were taking photos on the tracks that lie on the bridge snapshots that nearly had deadly consequences. Trains are very quiet while they're running. Union Pacific says most of the sound made by a train is behind it. That's why you can hear me so well as this train passes by. It's also why if you're on the tracks trespassing, it may be too late until you realize what's headed your way. As soon as the engineer rounded the curve, he saw them and started blowing his horn and bell as much as he could, make as much noise as possible, and they started running. And then one of them unfortunately tripped and rolled off the bridge. The other one was able to run a little faster and got off the bridge. Somehow the girls didn't get hit. And aside from being shaken up and taking a tumble, they're okay. Mountain Green Fire Chief Brian Brendel wants this message to be heard as loud as a train horn. You don't want to wager that, oh, I'm going to bet that no train comes because I want to get a really good picture. This view may be stunning, but nothing about it is worth risking a life. I saw a bumper sticker yesterday that said, I hope something really good happens to you today. Something really good happened to us last night. Union Pacific says anyone who is caught trespassing on their property like their tracks can be cited. In Mountain Green, John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah. Wow, so dangerous. While deadly crashes at railroad crossings have decreased over the past decade, experts are reporting more drivers going around lowered gates. The Federal Railroad Administration says in 2018, over 330 drivers went around a gate and were struck by a train. It led to 99 deaths, marking a 10-year high. It is illegal in every state to go around a lowered crossing gate or to ignore flashing signs.